He really, really, really wants a mouse. He wants one to pet and to play with. So last night I was at my class. We learned some good stuff, some really cool stuff. I'm not allowed to talk about it. <laughs> it's confidential stuff, so I'm, not, I'm really not allowed to talk about it really. Um, I can talk about my experience a little bit. Speaking of my experience, I saw something really cool outside while we were on our break. So this uh, helicopter went up. So our, our place that we're meeting at is right next to an airport. There was a uh, helicopter that went up. And the helicopter went up from the airport and had this gigantic American flag. And I captured a little clip of it for you. So here's a little piece of that clip. Wasn't that cool? That was cool, huh? So I thought that was amazing. So I was like, dude, get my camera. And I ran and grabbed my camera. Luckily, I keep my camera with me at all times because I'm a vlogger. <laughs> anyway, so I had a pretty good experience with my first day at the class. Um, this is an advanced version of a beginner class that I took before. So now we're on the advanced class. And we're learning a lot of stuff about teamwork. Really fun. Um, it's, it's scary. And there's a lot of like anxiety. And there's a lot of like... Don't pick on me, don't pick on me. Because, you know, if he picks on you, then you're going to get worked. <laughs> and it's, that could be scary, right? So, it's crazy. But at the same time, it, you learn a ton of stuff. And it's just like the communication that you have with people is so much better after you learn this stuff. And so, if you ever have a chance to take some sort of an empowerment course or something like that, I would totally recommend it. Um, get Look for one that's really going to dig deep in you and make you uncomfortable. I mean, look for ones that have crazy ratings. Like, you look, you, you look them up online and they're just crazy. And you want something that's going to make you feel uncomfortable. You want to get out of that comfort zone that you've gotten comfortable with for your whole life. And make different choices, you know? I mean, you choose what you're going to do. You choose who you're going to be. Every choice you make is going to make a difference. And it's hard to make a different choice. You know, your brain is used to going to a certain choice when a certain thing happens. You know, someone tells you something, you feel a certain way, you choose to react a certain way, and it's just, you've programmed yourself to be that way. And so, it's all about making a new choice. So, you can do this. Uh, but yeah, go, go find some sort of an empowerment course and check it out. I can even uh, send you to the guy that I'm going to. You guys can check him out, okay? Um, but it's very, it's very, it's not, I don't, I don't, don't want to not say it's fun because it's fun, but then saying it's fun, it's like, well, that's not fun. But then there's stuff that's fun. So <laughs> it is, it's very amazing the results that you get. So go check something like that out. Take my word for it really seriously and go do this. Don't take my word on what I'm saying. Just go do it <laughs> and then you'll get it. So check that out. I'm on my way to go get Sean a mouse. He really, really, really wants a mouse. He wants one to pet and to play with and to click. Wait, click? Hi, you probably thought that I was talking about a real mouse, you know, like a little real mouse. <laughs> no, I'm gonna go get him a, um, a mouse for the computer because his mouse is just automatically double clicking on its own. I'm gonna go get him a nice little wireless mouse because uh, the one that he has is wired and he always complains about the, the wire on it. Actually, he doesn't really complain about it, but um, he's made comments that he wants wireless stuff like 
wireless um, keyboard and wireless mouse and all that sort of stuff. So I'm going to go find him a wireless mouse. <laughs> Comment below if you thought that I was talking about a real mouse. I found perfect mouse for Sean. It's big and it rolls and here it is. Ooh. See reflection through there. Hi self. Anywho, well, here is the mouse that I found for Sean. And it's his favorite color, it's blue. So I found Sean's mouse and I hope he loves it. So I'm gonna set it up and play with it today and uh, see how it works. So after I went to Best Buy, I went to a few other stores and um, I went to Kohl's and I found this little swimsuit set here. So here's the pants. And these pants are a little different because they have a little skirt here. <laughs> so instead of just wearing it so it looks like, you know, like pants or, um, you know, swimsuit, whatever you call it. I don't know what you call it. What do you call, what do you call that part of the pants or for swimsuits? And then here's the top part that I found for a swimsuit. I thought this was pretty cool. And it has like a modest neckline. So... So I won't be you know, wearing something where it's you know showing down here a lot and everything. And then I also found these shorts for real cheap too. Oops, dropped them. Found these shorts for real cheap too, and they match because they have the blue color. That's also the blue color here. So I found this nice little set, and it only cost like 30 bucks or something. It was really, really inexpensive. It was really cool. So I like my little set that I have here. So now. You just have to go to a lake or a pool or somewhere and go swimming and use it. Totes, my goats. And then I also went to the grocery store and, um, and craft store for some craft stuff. And I could not find glycerin every, anywhere. Um, I looked everywhere at Walmart. I could not find it in the health area. I could not find it in the first aid area. I couldn't find it in the area where there's like deodorant and shaving stuff. And I did my research on the internet to find it, and I could not find it anywhere. And I need it for one of my crafts, although it's optional. But I wanted to use it because I want to make my craft look cool. So, and I have to hold off on that craft until I can find this glycerin that I'm looking for. And you think it wouldn't be so hard to find, but it is hard to find! Oh, how cute! Two little matching mice. Two blind mice. Two blind mice. Yeah, you know the song, Three Blind Mice. We've got two blind mice. Two blind mice. Cool. So we have this one for the computer, and this one's for the laptop. And we've had this one for a long time, and it works really, really well. It's super nice. And it's really compact. So I was comparing the size, and it's a little bit smaller than this one. So hopefully Sean's good with this one, because that was the biggest that I could find that didn't have, like, a ton of, like, high-tech stuff to it. There was like a really cool one that looked like a little remote and it was like this little flat thing and then it like kind of swerved up a little bit and then you just like touch it and it does stuff but um, I thought that was a little too, too technical for Sean and I figured a regular mice would be perfect. So here's our new mice, mouse. Ooh, so nice. What a nice little mouse. Got another sprinkler leak. Good times in the yard, man. See, there's so many pros and cons of owning versus renting. If you own a house, everything's on you. But you can do whatever you want. So you can upgrade things, you can change things, you can paint the wall whenever you want. You don't have to get permission. Where if you rent a house, they take care of everything for you. If something's broken, you call them, they fix it. You know, your dryer breaks, if it's their dryer, if it's something they're doing, they replace the dryer. There's a hole in the wall, they come fix the hole in the wall. If the sprinklers break, they come fix it. You know, your air conditioner, whew, that's going to be fixed quickly in the summer around here. But as a homeowner, we love owning our home, but man, having to do all these little things and just, you, you got to buy all the stuff, you got to learn all these things, or you got to pay someone to do it. You know, and with our irrigation, I just don't. I don't know much about irrigation like I don't know what's causing all these leaks to happen all the time our sprinklers are just always leaking water we turn off the sprinklers the water still comes out I'm confused what water's off why is it coming out so 
If anyone knows anything about irrigation, please let me know about it. Help me out. Help me please. Okay? Thank you. That's that's what I got for you guys today in the vlog. Just wanted to have a little FaceTime with you, you know, just some chat, chat, chat right at ya. I know, I'm cheesy, I'm a nerd. Shut up, Sean. Gosh. So, today, while I'm filming this, by the time you see it, it'll be too late, it'll be the next day, um, is the Hot Wheels tournament over at the Fun Awesome channel with Micah Stubbs. Um, you guys can watch the aftermath, I guess, by the time this is up. I don't know if it'll be ready or not, but whenever I see it, I'll put a link in the description for you, and you can go check out the results of that Hot Wheels thing, see if it's something you might want to do next year if you didn't get to do it this year. It was really fun um, to even begin participating with it, um, but it's going to happen today at 3 o'clock Saturday, okay? I know by the time you watch this, it's going to be Sunday, but um, or even later, depending on when you watch this video, but it should be up on Sunday, and um, I think think we can get on a webcam and be involved but I'm not sure we've never done this before it's our first time but we've bought the cars and we sent them out and I've seen our names up on the website so we know he's got our cars and um, I'll put the link to the website down there and you can go check out his website and just see what's on those videos of us getting the cars you've, if you're on this channel you've probably seen that video um, picking up the Hot Wheel cars uh, there's other people's videos of them picking out their cars, people doing little vlogs, a lot of fun stuff. So definitely um, go check out that website and see what you think. Alrighty, uh, that's all I got. I will see you guys tomorrow. Welcome to the Bracketeers in Slate. So I'm sure you thought we bought a mouse for sure. A real one, a live one. Or maybe just found one running around. <laughs> so check out yesterday's video. It's pretty cool also. And click on the mystery vlog to check out our random mystery vlog. We got them other channels there. And we got some cool stuff in the works going on. And uh, check out our social networks. You can click the links below. And don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe so that you can see all our videos, the pe previous ones, and our future ones. And it'll you'll get the email saying that our new video is up. So check it out, and cue that insulate music! Button to 